What's up everybody, this is Tanner from the School of Trading. Um, in today's video I want to do a quick review of a recent play that I made and one that I was actually sending out via our Twitter feed at Trading School for You. And it's a very simple play and a very simple breakout play that we teach in our trading course. And the reason I want to show you this is because I want to get across to everybody why you should take that 8-10% to gain when it's given to you. Okay, Don't always look for humongous runs. Take the 8-10% to gain when it's given to you and that's what will keep you in this trading game long term. Okay, So when we look at this AXU chart, I'm going to show you exactly what I was seeing, where I entered essentially, I kind of, I think on this one had a few entry points, and where I exited. Now as you can see with AXU we have a clear bottom channel line here. Okay, We have this clear bottom channel line and we have this clear top channel line. And those of you in our course know that I teach a lot of channel trading because it's incredibly straightforward and effective. So we see with this channel, it was bouncing off the support line, bouncing off the resistance line. Okay, It had set this clear channel for us. So as it began to come down from this 67.8 high, 0.67.8 high, and get down in this area, I began to take notice, and that's actually where I entered this trade, in the 0.45 area. Okay, in the 0.45 area. And my goal was to play this upwards towards 0.50. All right, towards 0.50. But I wasn't going to be greedy though. I would take 0.495 and change if it was given to me quickly. Because I had noticed something on this play. Yes, I had noticed that it seen bounces off this channel and eventually came up here. But along the way, it tended to see small runs, pull back, and then a run. Same thing here. It comes down, small run, pull back. Another small run pulls all the way back and then a run. So it wasn't a clear bounce and all the way to the top. So what happened for me essentially was I got in around 0.45 and as it came up and set this black candle and started to get around the 0.49 plus range but I noticed a lot of selling volume was coming in, I went ahead and exited the trade at 0.493 roughly and, and got my profit. Now you might think, oh that's a small gain, 0.45 to 0.493. But the reality is that's 8 to 10% and over time those are going to build up and you're going to, your trading account is going to grow and you're going to be incredibly successful. Now what I'm looking at here is as this came down again, I'm eyeing it for another potential reversal as it set, starts to set somewhat of a doji candle and potentially starts to reverse upward. I may again play it from that 0.45 to the 0.50 range. So instead of me kind of hoping and praying that this goes all the way up to 0.678, I have the opportunity to play it potentially multiple times and gain more profit than if I just played it all the way up. Okay, Don't get in a trade and just hope and pray that it does exactly what you think it's going to do. Be aware of the selling volume, be aware of the momentum, and exit when you need to exit. Take that 8-10% to 10 trade. If it keeps, keeps running after that, don't let that bother you because 8 out of 10 times it's going to reverse downwards and when you stay in it you're going to be regretting that you didn't take that. 10% profit when you had it. So I wanted to show you this trade just to kind of get across the importance of taking profit when it's in front of you, paying attention to the chart, paying attention to selling volume. Had this day set a nice big strong white candle, I may have stayed in it as volume continued to push it higher. But I noticed that the, the 20 moving average was starting to dip down, it crossed over the 50 moving average, momentum was starting to turn against it, so I went ahead and exited the trade and took my profit. Hey, I, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's a quick just review of one of the trades I made. Um, I'm actually currently recording some of our live trades, so you can get a better in-depth look of me actually placing trades, exiting trades. They're not all wins. Some of them are, some of them aren't, but the reality was I want to be as completely transparent as possible. I don't want you to think that this is a trading is you're going to win all the time. You're going to have losses. The key is just to minimize your losses and get the best out of your trades possible. So if you're interested in our trading course and you're interested in seeing the techniques we teach, that can make plays like this even more clear, how we tweak the indicators, how we set things up. I have everything on its basic right here. If you're interested in that, visit mytradingschool.com and you can sign up for our course today. If you have any questions about it, if you're not sure, you want me to explain a little more to you, go ahead and shoot me an email at tannerstrading at gmail.com and I'll make sure to go more in depth about what we offer, what you can expect, you know what some other people have said about it. Reception's been great so far. People are really enjoying it. Some of the students are emailing me with some of the plays they're making, and they're absolutely fantastic. They're picking it up even quicker than I expected. 
The reality is trading doesn't need to be hard. We try to simplify it for you. And so I really hope to be able to work with some of you. Have a great day.